there are three types of conditional sentences. There's the future, the present, and the past. The future conditional sentence is the easiest. If I need help, I'll call you. The verb after if is in the present tense, and this contraction is I will. In the present conditional, after if, you use the past tense, needed. Now the situation is present, but you have to use a past tense verb. If I needed help, I would call you. In the second part of the sentence, use would and the simple form of the verb. In the past conditional, you're going to use the past perfect after if. If I had needed help, I would have called you. Use would, then have, and this is the past participle. The verb have is often used in conditional sentences. In the future conditional, the subject here is she. If she has the time, she'll go. In the present conditional, here's the verb have, but it's in the past tense. If she had the time, she would go. You can also use a contraction here. You can say, if she had the time, she'd go. And as you see here in the past conditional, you can also use a contraction. If she'd had the time, she would have gone. But this contraction is, she had. Sometimes it's a little confusing to use conditional sentences with negative verbs. In the future conditional, if he doesn't want it, he won't buy it. This is for the future. Now, the verb here is in the present tense negative. For the present conditional, if he didn't want it, he wouldn't buy it. The situation is present, but you make the verb negative. And in the past conditional, if he hadn't wanted it, he wouldn't have bought it. This is the past perfect, and it's negative. This sounds a little strange, so if you want to say, if he didn't want it, he wouldn't have bought it. That's okay. 